Come on, boys. OK, so your neighbor's dog. Don't let them get close. Easy. Easy. Don't let them get close. Hey. hey. Don't let them get close. Hey. 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 All right. Casper. Casper's aggressiveness has really been going to another level. He's getting worse by the day. Could you just walk him away and see what he does? He backs away. Interesting. OK. Right, doesn't want to do it. Nice. Practices avoidance. Like it. This is good. When the dog came back, Casper took steps back. This isn't a dog that's nasty. This is a dog that essentially is very uncomfortable around other dogs. All right, he's scared. He's scared? He's scared. Really? Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. That's what all of this stuff is. He's scared. The reason why he's, he did that, it's a great defensive measure. Get the other dog to go away. Makes him feel good. But then when the dog came back again, he backed up. I never in a million years would think Casper afraid. No, he's too tough. And to actually find out that he's just putting up that facade because he's afraid, I couldn't believe it. I wanted to start the training off on neutral territory. Casper's really reactive on walks, so I'm hoping that if Denise sees Mark making more of an effort to train him, she's going to see more hope for the future. I wanted to bring him here because I really want to modify Casper's reaction when he sees another dog. I surprised you, I think, when I told you that Casper was actually scared. Yes. When you think about an aggressive person, why do you think that person's aggressive? Insecure. Insecurity. Same for a dog. Because really, a secure dog is confident. Doesn't need to show aggression, because it's just confident. Victoria did say that Casper lashes out when he's afraid, which it does make sense now that she pointed it out. It would have never occurred to me. OK, I'm going to take him here. Casper. I'm going to get his focus on me. Sit. Watch me. Good boy. If you train your dog whenever you say, watch me, to turn from anything they're doing to look at you, that's great. That's the kind of cue word that you have to build up. Great way to get focus. The watch me cue is really important. If you charge it up enough times, whenever you say, watch me, your dog will go from whatever it's doing and look straight in your eyes. So now we're going to have Ritza bring in Angus. Good boy. Nice. I like the fact that he turns his head away. Instead of reacting, he's practicing avoidance. And you have to praise that. You have to mark that, OK? This training teaches Casper that he has choices. He can make the choice to turn away from the dog rather than have to greet the dog. And that makes him feel much more comfortable. I'm going to go a little bit closer. Sit. Good boy. Good. Sit. Good boy. Watch me. Good boy. I was very much surprised that Casper wasn't more aggressive than what he was. He seemed to start to get used to the fact of another dog in his space. All right, I want you to come over here, and I want you to take over what I'm doing. OK. I don't want you to let Casper get close to Angus. No. All right, Rita, would you mind moving away? Sure. Coming back again? Angus. Good. Watch any kind of the way. Good. Nice. That's what I want him to do. That's perfect. By doing this, you're giving him confidence. That's what he needs, confidence. The more Casper gets rewarded around other dogs for calm behavior, the more he's going to associate other dogs with good things happening to him. Therefore, that's going to make him less reactive. Would you mind getting him up and walking around sure. as well? Sure. Let's go, Angus. So there's one thing getting your dog to sort of sit whilst the other dog's going by, but I want you to be able to walk by another dog that's walking by. Good. Go 
good. Oh my. Nice praise, very good. good so now I'd like you to take him. I was feeling very nervous and worried that maybe this wasn't going to work out. Anticipation was killing me. Go round the other way, good cross boy. each other's path. Good boy. Casper, good boy, come on. Good boy. Good boy, Casper. Casper, come on. Good boy. Good, good, nice. Boy. In the past, I've been afraid to walk Casper because of his behavior, but I think what Victoria taught us today, I could definitely have a handle on it. He is completely ignoring him. Yeah. Good boy, Casper. Good yeah, boy. Yeah, that was close. Good boy. I'm seeing some progress, but this is just the first step. Casper has a long history of reactivity, so it's gonna take a while to change that behavior. When Victoria left, Mark and I continued the training. Let's go. When I walk Casper, and if my neighbor Patrick is also out, we actually can, you know, have a conversation together and walk the dogs at the same time. That, that we could never do before.